Hi everyone. Uh, I bet you guys didn't think you'd hear from me in ever. I know you guys are wondering like, why does this girl make one or two videos a year? I don't want to make YouTube my life. Um, YouTube doesn't pay my bills. So I consistently doing videos, um, you know, it's not what I'm about. I've never done that, which I probably should try. I mostly do beauty related videos on things that I find important and I don't like to make up topics to talk about, especially when I don't feel that they're close to my heart. I thank my subscribers for hanging in there with me and still subscribing to me after all this time I've been on YouTube. I've been on YouTube now for many, many years. Um, I've been on YouTube since 2006. So for all my new subscribers out there, thank you so much. And for all my old ones, thank you, thank you, thank you immensely for sticking with me. But I was actually at the laser hair removal treatment place today and I thought, oh my gosh, my video diary, totally forgot about it. So I wanted to come and do a recap of what's been going on with that and the ins and the outs of the laser hair removal Groupons, um, the good, the bad, and the very ugly. So stay tuned. So, as you guys knew from my previous video, I got the laser hair removal Groupon. And um, there are a couple of things I did not know about laser hair removal um, initially, like the laser that they were using is IPL. And for those of you who are hip to the laser hair business, you guys know IPL is not laser. It's called the Infused Pulsating Light, I think, Pulsate Fuse. It's not a laser. And that's the gimmick with the Groupon. Usually with the Groupons, they use um, IPLs. So with IPLs, they don't permanently remove all of your hair. And that's what I learned when I got there. She said, all your hair won't come out with this. You'll need you know, you'll probably need another Groupon, she said. You'll need at least eight more additional treatments on top of what she gave me already. Okay, so the results. After three uh, sessions, I noticed that my hair was coming out and um, I did notice, I did notice burning. Um, the lady actually scarred me um, I don't want to scare people out there, but it's a burn scar. It's like a small burn, you know. Back in the day when you get relaxers, you had those little burns. Yeah, I was getting them in the places that she was, you know, um, treating. So I automatically was like, this is not right. <laughs> and if it is, I don't know if I want this to be part of my life anymore. Um, knowing that I already had paid a couple hundred dollars for this, I went and I did my research and I went for all of my eight sessions and after that, I still have hair. And it's the same amount of hair as it was before I was going. My hair came out um, as it was supposed to, um, she said, with the treatments. It was coming out. And then a month later, I'll be back. It just kind of like, oh, came out, and then proceeded to come back out. Like, oh, okay, this is a new me. This is what my hair was saying. Uh, I noticed that my hair did come back, like all of it came back. So the eight treatments that I did do was for nothing. Last time I did go for my laser removal, they asked me if I wanted to buy another eight sessions. And that right there is an indication that it doesn't work. I still wanted this hair removed and I recently went to a really credible place. Um, I guess I can say their names on here. Uh, Ideal Image. And it's definitely not a Groupon that they offer. I am paying thousands of dollars to get my hair removed. Uh, so would I suggest or would I recommend the Groupons for anybody? No, I don't recommend those laser hair removal Groupons at all to anybody, anywhere. Save your money and go get it professionally. I'm not saying it's not professionally done, but save your money and get it done at a credible place as opposed to those med spas. As you know, it's probably a Groupon for a med spa because it's not going to work. 
I wouldn't recommend those package deals like Groupon or like Living Social. I would not recommend those to anybody anywhere now after having that ordeal happen to me. But if you guys have, you know, any other opposing opinions, you know, comment below, write it down. Let me know um, how it worked for you because I have heard about people that got it done and then had all their hair removed. Um, but I haven't heard about somebody that had their hair removed and it never grew back within a couple of months. So let me know um, if you guys have had some good experiences. I'll put my updated hair regime, which you probably don't want to know because my hair looks like this right now, <laughs> but I'm about to go watch it. Um, so. Uh, see you guys later. Thank you for watching and have a great day. <laughs>